today we shall reflect on the life of Saint Paul of the Cross, the eldest of sixteen children of an impoverished noble family who had become merchants in Lombardy. Paul Francis Dane was born on the third of January, sixteen ninety-four, to Luke Dane and Anna Marie Massari. Much given to prayer before the Blessed Sacrament, he was at the age of twenty-six shown by our Lord in a vision that he was to found a new religious order in the honor of the Passion. In 1720, he drew up the rule for the discalced clerks of the Cross and the Passion. Seven years later, he was ordained priest and community life was started in a small hermitage on Mount Argentario near Orbetello, and much against his wishes, he was elected superior general, which he remained until his death. The order combined Carthusian austerity with Jesuit pro-civility, with Jesuit proclivity to bring souls to Christ through a devout contemplation of his passion. God favored Paul's work with numerous miracles, especially in connection with the conversion of hardened and hopeless sinners. Throughout his priestly life, he prayed for the return of England to the faith and was vouchsafed several comforting visions in this connection. In fact, it was through the Passionists that Cardinal Newman, among thousands of others, entered the church. Paul died in Rome on the 18th of October, 1775, and was canonized by Pope Pius IX on the 29th of June, 1867.